Well, there's controversy ahead of this year's Academy Awards. Some actors are threatening to boycott the ceremony because no black actors were nominated. Faiza Ahmad has the story. The Oscars are an occasion for Hollywood to showcase its best films, actors and filmmakers. But this year, they've been hit by a race row that threatens to overshadow the glitz and the glamour. Prominent black artists have lashed out at the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences, saying there is a lack of diversity in this year's nominations. Director Spike Lee took to social media with the hashtag Oscars so white to announce he was boycotting the ceremony and demanded to know how is it possible for the second consecutive year all 20 contenders under the actor category are white. They want you to say you made it a film that's attracted headlines is Concussion. It stars Will Smith, who many critics thought would be nominated for an Oscar. He was not, and now his wife, the actress Jada Pinkett Smith, has joined the boycott. Begging for acknowledgement or even asking diminishes dignity and diminishes power. And we are a dignified people and we are powerful. And let's not forget it. So let's let the Academy do them with all grace and love. And let's do us differently. Academy head Cheryl Boone Isaac said she was heartbroken and frustrated about the lack of inclusion. Well, don't just talk, you got to do. Talking gets to the do, and we are going to do. And this is a very important initiative of the Academy, and I do believe of the industry, and it is an industry-wide situation. A conversation and a row that will continue beyond next month's Oscar ceremony. Pfizer Ahmed, TRT World, London. Well, for more on this story, I'm joined by Dasha Illich. She's a spokeswoman for the Media Diversity Institute. She joins me now live from London. Just very quickly, Dasha, if you will, just explain what your institute does. Well, as I would say, uh, we are talking about this problem, lack of diversity at the Oscars ceremony. Uh, because it's about celebrities, it's about show business, and it's about because some celebrities decided to boycott this problem. But you see, we at uh, the Media Diversity Institute, we are talking about this problem as a persistent problem in our society and world every single day. Um, I would just say that this is a symptom. Um, ceremonies and uh, not only Oscars awards, but Grammy awards, BAFTAs, etc. This is only symptoms. We have to tackle the root of the problem. Why there is no more minorities, more women, more people of color, more LGBT people? Well, what are the reasons for that then? The film industry. What are the reasons for that, Dasha? What are the fundamental issues then? If this is, if this is a symptom, what are the fundamental issues? We are trying to answer that question, we at the Media Diversity Institute, for almost 20 years. But I would say that we shouldn't be generalizing and answering in general terms this question. Uh, lack of diversity varies from country to country. But I would say that exclusion of others, basically, um, you have majority, which is on the example of Oscars and Academy Awards members. More than 90 people are white, more than 70 people are male. So there you go. Dasha, why, are you saying that the Academy is racist? I didn't say that, and I can't say that. I'm just saying that in the structural terms, they have mostly white members and male members. You know, when you look at the world from that perspective, you might see the world differently than it is. Because if you look at the nominees of Oscar ceremonies today, they are all white. But our world is not white only. OK, what about Cheryl Boone Isaac? She's the head of the uh, Academy of uh, Motion Pictures and Arts and so on. Uh, she is a black lady in the United States. Why do you think she hasn't been able to change things for the past two years? We have to emphasize that this is uh, not a problem that can be solved just like that by one lady who's leading uh, the academy. This is a systematic problem, and all of us have to work on that. Okay, so, so she's finding resistance. Well, where, is, where is the resistance coming from? You have to put a finger on this. Resistance coming from the media, from the film industry, from the policy makers, from the editors, from every single people, every single of us 
who don't realize that there is lack of diversity. And then you have black actors, you have minorities, excluded people, boycotting, for example, Oscar ceremonies. But I would ask why others don't join that boycott? Why we are debating and discussing this problem without realizing when there is lack of diversity around ourselves. That's what MDI, Media Diversity Institute, is trying to do, okay. not only in America, not only in the UK, but all over the world. Okay, Dash Illich from the Media Diversity Institute in London, thank you very much for your time. Nine officials from the tourism companies in Israel have been arrested on suspicion of fixing prices on